top four Illuminati New World Order events. Number one, the Great War. As history has shown, it is around the end of the Great War conflagrations when a new geopolitical order is discussed, negotiated, and finally agreed upon by the victorious powers. Based on the quota of power that each one has achieved and in line with their respective economic and strategic interests. More specifically, it is the leaders of those powers who define the terms of the pact and the contours of the new order. When the end of the First World War was near, U.S. President Woodrow Wilson formulated his famous 14 points, which he made public in a speech before the U.S. Congress in January 1918. Jackson and Sirenson, 2003, 37. These points, which epitomized the liberal internationalism in vogue in those years, would later become the main guidelines of the Treaty of Versailles and later the core principles of the League of Nations that was created to implement and monitor the application of said treaty.
Number 4. The Post-Cold War Disorder From an ideological point of view, the end of the Cold War marked the triumph of capitalism, the enthronement of Western democracy, and the defeat of real socialism. In the absence of a viable alternative, Western democracy was thus proclaimed as the universal norm of organization and political coexistence, and the market as the undisputed mechanism of social aggregation, and the supreme principle of productive coordination in countries of all latitudes. A general euphoria invaded the world as a result, together with the firm belief that the simultaneous triumphs of capitalism and democracy were events inextricably linked to each other, Gunder Frank. 1993. The culminating expression of these emotions was the interpretation by Francis Fukuyama, 1989, that this double triumph was an unequivocal indication that humanity had reached the climax of its social evolution, and that history had therefore arrived to its end.